off? Yeah, why would he kill off someone he loves? Because that's that's what you have to do. Hey, let me get a scripture for you. Brother, you, I'm sorry, but you confused. Hey, you, I'm, 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 I'm confused. I'm not confused. Yeah, you I mean, confused. Okay. The, 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 whole point of, the whole point of Revelation... Hey, you're teaching, you're you're like you're teaching witchcraft now. Get yeah, Hebrews, <laughs> yeah, yeah, Hebrews 5, bro. You wouldn't need to teach you what I guess he's going to... So you believe, you believe in hating people? Yes, yeah, yes. I mean, yeah. Yeah, but it says in the Bible not to harbor, harbor anger evil. towards anyone. I hate evil. Get uh, get Hold on. Uh, get Romans. Get Romans shit. 9 and 13. That's what I was looking for, too. That's people, but what you, what you fail to well, understand is that bit. people <laughs> aren't evil, okay? Oh, uh, there's some evil but the, people. But the, <laughs> but the sin inside them is evil. No, they hate the sin. No, no, here you go. The Lord said The Lord said the wicked are straight. Hold up. The Lord said the wicked are estranged from the womb. As soon as they be born, they be speaking lies. Who is he referring to? That's a, he, just, he just quoted it. Yeah. You don't need to get it. The wicked are estranged from the womb. As soon as they are born, they speaketh lies. Right. Who are the wicked? The wicked is everybody. It's you and I. Well, no, I don't think so. Yeah, you I don't think speaking so. Lies. I came out the womb you, speaking lies. Everybody I'm not the wicked. The you're speaking as, as if you're wicked. Uh, you are speaking. You're speaking as if right you're now. a wicked man. You're, speaking, you're talking like Esau right now. Right. Listen, Romans 9 and 13. As it is written. As it is written. Jacob have I loved. This is God talking. But Esau have I hated. The Lord said if he came to save all people and loves everybody, read that again. As Jacob it is written. Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. Keep going, there's more to that. Okay. What shall we say then? Is there unrighteousness with the most high? So since God hates people, does that mean he's unrighteous? God? That's what he's asking. He's asking is since God hates Let me people. Read again. Make God what shall we say then? Is there unrighteousness so you gotta, you with gotta, the most high? You gotta forget all that bullshit you learned <laughs> and listen to the truth. Get it, let me get it. All, all that mess you've been taught is all wrong. Got wrong, right? wrong, 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 wrong. It's all lies. It's, it's, that's, that's what you call deception. Here you go. This is Hebrews 5 and 12. Oh, for yes. Me. This is a good one. For when, for the time ye ought to be teachers, ye have need that one teach you again. That's what it's called to be reborn, to truly be reborn. Read yeah. Romans 7 and 8, man. Which be the first principle of the oracles of the Most High, and are become such as have need of milk and not a strong meat. So what you got to be reborn, and to you got to come back and, and you got to suck on that, on, on, on your mama's titty, big, meta metaphorically speaking. big breastesis. Yeah, but to get some good milk. No. Because you can't, you can't eat no meat. <laughs> so we try to suck get, on that titty. You got to learn it. You got to learn the basics. You don't know the basics. Right. The basics is the Lord is only dealing with Israel. Right. The Lord loves, the Lord loves Israel. He loves Jacob and he hates Esau. He hates, you know who Esau is today? Well, he's walking around, you see him every day, he's a so-called white man. Now, you heard notice I said so-called white man. Did Jehovah's oh, Witnesses teach that? Uh, I, I, don't, I don't... You said we was like Jehovah. Do they teach that he's a white Jehovah man? Witness teaches that only 244,000 people 144,000 people well, look, are going to that's survive. A, no, that's not that's true. Just the going to that's, that's just the elect. That's just the elect. That's the first fruit. There's going to be a lot more than that getting saved. A lot more. But the 144,000 is the elect. That's the prophets. That's the thousand of those right. are the wise, the wise men. Okay, those that's the uh, the elect. They're the ones that's going to be turned into super. That's us. The men of the Lord is actually doing the work. Right. But the more people than that's going to be saved. Right. But still, one more, third of our. One, one there third. will be a lot of people destroyed though. One Two third. third. Yeah, only one third of Israel is going to make it. Two only, thirds. and that's a, and that's still a mighty number. Yeah. But two thirds of our people are going to burn in that fire that this Bible speaks of. But here you go, right here. This is Psalms, um, one forty-seven and nineteen. He showeth his word unto Jacob, his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. Oh, Israel. Yes. He has not dealt so with any nation. And as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye the Lord. So the Lord says it's all about Israel. Okay, the Lord's people is Israel. That's what it's all about. Ain't no Gentiles. This, the Gentile, give me a uh, First Corinthians. Uh, uh, Okay, man. 12 and 2. Uh, what? Uh, what book is it? Uh, don't worry about it. You, I told you guys to forget. It's Paul, Paul wrote a letter. And what, what book is it? Uh, I'm sorry, Matthew, one, Mark, Luke, John, Acts. Well, Acts. Paul didn't write Acts. Luke wrote Acts. <laughs> <laughs> Paul is in Acts, though. Huh? He talking about Romans. Romans. Okay, yes, Romans. Sorry. <laughs> you. 
Dude, that's smart. Paul, <laughs> Paul of Romans to the Jews. To the Gentiles. Right. To the Jews. No, no. The, what, what's the name of the book of Romans? Romans. Romans. So who did he write that to? <laughs> Romans. Right, because Romans. Paul was the perfect person to write it to Listen, because he was a Roman. I'm about to break it down to you. Paul was a Roman. Right. But was he really a Roman? Yeah. No, he was not. Mm, no. Give no. me a, because there's no such thing. He was born a Roman. There's no such right. thing as a Roman in the Bible, though. Because the, there's no nation in the Bible called the Romans. Right. It's not an actual nation. What it is is a confederate of, of people who came together and built a nation. Right. Because Paul they, was an Israelite. Rome was like America. It was it was multicultural. So but he right. qualified to be a Roman. Roman. That's why he could go in yeah, front of Caesar. Well, I know what you're saying, but hold and on. Give me a... That one that says Paul was a from the tribe of Benjamin. He never heard that. Oh, yeah. Paul, 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 Paul's from the tribe of Benjamin, and the nation of Israel. Okay, that tells you that. Uh, what's that? Romans 12. It tells you that. It tells you Paul's from the tribe of Benjamin. And he was speaking to Israelites living in Rome. Brothers that he woke up. They, they probably thought they was Roman, but Paul gave them the truth, and he woke them up to the truth. And they were actually Israelites. Hey, people just, over here that call himself American. Just like the ancient Greeks were actually Israelites. Have you ever heard the alphabet before? Yeah. What does alphabet mean? Where does that come from? I don't know. Alphabet. Our alphabet comes from the Greek alphabet. Okay, and alphabet co actually comes from the Hebrew. The letter A that we use today actually goes all the way back to ancient Hebrew. And alphabet is Hebrew. Okay. Alpha is a Hebrew word. And bet is a Hebrew word. Bet means house. Okay, alpha can mean a thousand. All right, and there's an actual Hebrew word. And the Greeks got their alphabet from the Israelites, because they were Israelites. But they lost their way, they started following heathen gods, okay? Uh, what you got? This, I'm read Romans 1, 9 and 1. All right, this, I, figured that I say the truth in Christ, oh, yeah. I lie not. My conscience also bearing me witness in the Holy Spirit. This is Paul talking, you talking about Paul. And this is in the book of Romans, and this is what he said to his brothers living in Rome. Keep going. That I have great heaviness and continual sorrow in my heart, for I wish that myself were a curse from Christ for my brethren. For his brethren. My kinsmen. His kinsmen. According to the flesh. According to the flesh. Who are Israelites. Who are Israelites. So he said his brothers are Israelites. Keep going. To, to, for who, to whom pertaineth the adoption. The adoption. And the glory. Keep going. And the covenants. The covenants, plural, meaning the old covenant and the new covenant. The old testament and the new testament. Keep going. And the giving of the law. The giving of the law. And the, the service. Like the Ten Commandments. Only, only Israelites got Ten Commandments up on their wall in their house. That, that law was only given to Israel. Okay, that's why all, that's why we all got Bible names. Uh, er, like you know, a lot of people, our people, their names are Joseph, Aaron, John, Paul, Paul. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's because we're Israelites. Okay. And the service of the Most High and the promises. And the, prom the, sir, and the promises. The promises were all given to uh, the Israelites. The Lord promised Abraham. He said, Abraham, I'm going to make you a seed as numerous as the stars of heaven and as many as the sands of the seashore. There's more Israelites on the planet Earth than any other people. You know what I'm saying? We're the most numerous nation. That's why you. That's why the scriptures say you got to teach the gospel to all nations, because Israel scattered among all nations. That's right, and, we, and and one of the results of being scattered amongst those nations, you get to having sex with their women, and you start to change. And obviously, where where the brother come from, where the brothers come from, you know what I mean? They're black men. I mean, that's a curse, though. That leprosy is a curse. Yeah. But they're black men. You know, that's why some of them can sing. That's why some are good guitarists, drummers, musicians, yep. actors. Because they're Israelites. They're actually black people. You know? Just like, uh, yeah, like athletes, like Brett Favre. You know Brett Favre. Well, I mean, that's a good example. <laughs> that, that's a bad dude right there. I'd rather use, I'd reason, I'd use another one. Like, I mean, the black dudes Larry love Bird, Favre, maybe. Though. Larry Bird. Oh, Larry, black dudes love black Larry man. Bird. Black, that's why when he was growing up as a kid, he didn't want to play with the white guys. He wanted to play with number of black guys. He yep. wanted to relate to them. You got to kick him. You know? You gotta, you I want to play with the best. Yep. You can, <laughs> you, can, like, you can only be around people who your spirit messes with. Right. And that's why Harry Bird was the great player he was. Because <laughs> he wasn't an Edomite. <laughs> this, this, hey, this truth is beautiful once you learn it, man. You wake up. Your eyes wake up. You are, your eyes open. Then you start to see things the way you're supposed to see. I love that. That there's actually wicked ass people walking around. It's, it's, wicked ass, wicked ass people. The seed is Satan. Right. The 
Esau. <laughs> what, what made Esau wicked? Though? The Most High made him that. The Most High made him to, to well, punish. Let's, let's, exa let's examine his great kingdom of called America. You right. can consider his Paul track wicked. Record okay, speak. let me. Let's, you let's go down to Paul wicked because he went around crucifying. He forgot. He got his forgiveness. Yeah, 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 right. He's an Israelite. That's right. he won't okay. go. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's you, an can, you can be a murderer and the Lord will forgive you. That's what you. You That's can kill. The Lord forgives everybody. No, he don't forgive it's everybody. It's up to him if he's going to forgive. He ain't going to forgive no Edomite. If, it, if it's written, what okay, then why did Jesus do, Christ die on the cross? If it's written, forgive the Israelites. For, yeah, yeah, of course. And get that in Acts the fifth chapter. It tells you. Uh, uh, Acts the fifth chapter where it says he slung on a tree. I'm going to get a scripture. Go ahead. He died for Israel's sin. Uh, Romans 10 and 2. For I bear the record. That they have a zeal of God, but not according to knowledge. Yeah, all these people in this, a lot of some people in these churches, most of them are retards. But there'd be a few people, they really trying to follow the Lord, they really don't you know, truly believe in the most high. Or the scripture requires too far to you. Yeah, it could be. You know, but that's why we're trying to wake you up, you know, to the truth. And not be continually walking blind that be like us these these damn preachers and deceive the shit out of them. Right. You know right. what I mean? Right. Just because you got a fine car and wearing a suit and got a big ass, wicked ass satanic temple. And they passing out sandwiches you know? and getting free coffee right. and snacks. That's not a holy man. Those are people that are serving Baal. Who he Baal, said Kanye Baal, for Baal Jesus. Baal is a community god. Baal. Baal. What, is, what, is the Baal. what does the Bible say about Baal? The yeah, they always you know? talking about we got to help the community. Go to your community church. Well, the Lord got you out there struggling. That's because he wants you struggling. And what are you doing helping somebody that the Lord said, the Bible says, don't help the ungodly. He says, give not that bread unto the wicked. Yeah, it's a, like a lot of these churches, the only reason they got people in there is because they're giving away free food, passing out lunches. Now, a lot of homeless people don't follow where the food is, just like they found the Lord around, because they knew the Lord was going to feed them. So the people, you know, they ain't really believing when that church is preaching. Yeah, half the people to follow the Lord when he had the loaves of bread and the fish. They were just following because they wanted to eat. And he, right. said, he actually said that as a part where he said something about that. Yeah, that's John 6. John 6 talks about defining people. There are three types of people in the world. Once, uh, once God broke broke the bread and the fish, that you had the people who believed in God and followed God. Then you had people who just wanted to follow God's miracles. And then you had other people are, no, 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 I'm sorry. You saw, you had the people who saw what God did and wanted to follow him. You had the people who had heard what God did or what Jesus had done. Yeah. What you got? Anybody have a scripture? I got up? this right here. I got Ecclesiastes uh, 12 and 1. That's a good one. When thou wilt do good, know to whom thou doest it. Yeah, you can't just do, do the every, I mean, you're good to help people, obviously. You know saying? No help people. But some people just they ain't right. And you ain't supposed, you're supposed to just stay away from certain people, period. Know okay. to whom thou doest, so shall, so shall thou be thanked for thy benefits. Do good to the un, to the godly man. So do good to the godly man. And thou shalt find a recompense, and if not from him, yet the from Bible the most though, high. Man. That is the yeah, Bible. This is the Bible. Bible. The Apocrypha. The Apocrypha. Where's that from? How many books are in the Bible? We got the King James Bible. Uh-huh, I'm going to hit him with something. How many, how many books are in the King James Bible? How many books are in the King James Bible? Uh, and the King James Bible without Apocrypha has 66 books. That's like a devil worshiper number. 66. So if your Bible, yeah. Because some devil worshippers actually took in the new King James Version. Show him what uh, their Bible is. That's a King James Bible. You need Bible. a new King James right. Version. All right, all right, okay. So NIV, the, whatever. It's not a real King James Bible unless it has this. Show him the front of that. What does that say on it? It says, authorized King James Version. And when the King James was originally published, there were 81 books in it. When the King James Bible was originally published, there was 81 books in it, and this is what you call the Apocrypha. It got the Book of Maccabees in it, it uh, got Judas, it got Ezra. And actually, when King James published it, they, they put a law out. They said if you publish any King James Bible without Apocrypha, you're going to get fined and put in jail. There was so an okay, actual so law. Got killed for yeah, you, you get, yeah. You know? But check this out. Um, but it was devil worshippers like Martin Luther who wanted to get it, they got, took it out of the Bible. That's right. Do Martin good. Luther King Jr. No, Martin Luther. No, Martin Luther. He's a devil worshipper, a right. big homosexual. He's an Edomite. Okay, do good to the godly man 
and shalt thou find a recompense, and if not from him, yet from the Most High. There can no good come to him that is always occupied to evil. Yeah, so there's no good. If you see one of these no good people, they don't be trying to help them, because that a lot of them look come up and ask for change, and uh, they they just using you, man. And they, they they'll have they'll actually sit out there on the corner and beg. They they got lots of money anyway. They know that people are stupid enough just to give them money. Right. That's a hustle. Too. Nor to him that giveth no all. Like every like we get all kind of dudes come out here and be like, hey, you got some change for the bus? I mean, you ain't getting on the bus. You just want to get a bottle, a bottle of liquor or some wine. Yeah. Or, you know, get a bag or of weed. Some, right. Right. Give to the godly man. So give to the godly man. And help not a sinner. Help not a sinner. Do well unto him that is lowly. You're supposed to stay away from, okay, there's a difference between teaching someone to stop sinning. Like, I know the Bible says that the one you call Jesus sat with and ate with sinners, right? right? But he was giving them the truth. But after we know so, we done gave someone the truth once, or more than once, we told them time, time yeah. again, and, and you know they had demon, you stay the hell away from them. That's right, that's right. Okay, after you done mark them, and after you done talk, after you know so with a demon, there's no hope for them. You stay away from them. You ain't supposed to help them. There's, there's certain people you can just take one look at and you just know they ain't right. Yeah. No, they ain't yeah. right. That's right. Uh, wages of sin is death. Yeah, wages of sin is death. That's right. Do well unto him that is lowly, but give not to the ungodly. Yeah, like all these people, they walk around acting like that's not the Bible, man. No. That is the Bible. You just, you, that's, that's he different. just says the King James you, Bible, you, bro. Get yourself an original King James Bible, 1611 version. Yeah, that's the original. 19 what? 16, 1611, 1611 version. 19, 16, 16, 11. 16, 11. 16, 11. 16, 11. 16, 11. That's the, the original year, version. 16, 11. Yeah, the year 16, 11. <laughs> I got that's to tell you about that. 16, 11. Go a piece of them. Look, look, let me show you my right. Well, we all got them. You can get some King James with it in there. Matter of fact, they got the 1611 version Bible at the, the Barnes and Noble. And actually, to, remember? Yeah. And actually, most Christians oh, around the planet oh, Earth oh, have the Apocrypha in their Bible. Oh, like when you go, when you go to Syria, when you go to Russia, and any of these other countries, when you go to Greece, all these countries got the Apocrypha in their Bible. Oh, in their whatever language they speak, they got it in there, bro. When you read the Greek Bible, this is in there. Oh, when you read, you ever heard of the? Uh, the Septuagint, the ancient Greek Bible. These books were in the ancient Greek Bible. Russian. Well, no, the ancient Greek Bible. Okay, the Bible, or the Old Testament. This is all part of the Old Testament. In the Old Testament, the one you call Jesus read, the disciples read, uh, they, they, all these books was in there, bro. Okay? They got a scripture. In the New Testament. No, no, we, it's like maybe scattered over there. Just, you know, but uh, the old, their own, like the old SARS, SARS, yeah. they were Israelites. Yeah, like when you talking about, uh, we was talking about Jesus was black earlier. When you go to Russia, Russia have all kind of icons uh, from, from the Byzantine, you know who the Byzantine Empire is? You gotta know that. You don't know the Byzantine Empire, you don't know nothing about Christian history, okay? And that was the center, the capital. <laughs> Of, of, of Christians of the Israel, okay, it was in Constantinople, the modern, well, well modern day, it's called Constantinople, uh, it was called Constantinople for a thousand years, they changed the name to Istanbul, you ever Istanbul. heard of Istanbul? Yeah. Istanbul used to be called Constantinople, founded by Constantine the Great, okay, and then the, uh, the Israelite Christians moved there for a thousand years, this is actual history, and then after, and they had all their icons they painted of like, uh, the one you call Jesus and everyone else was all dark-skinned people. But after uh, uh, Byzantine fell, after Constantinople fell, uh, they took all those icons up to Russia. All the, all the pictures went up to Russia. So but Russia is like the successor to the Byzantine Empire. No, bro, that's not right. What are you doing? What are you talking about? Are you like staring at guys or something? What's up? You don't like pussy? Lust? What's wrong? Lust? See, what did say yeah. back in the day? You're not supposed to, hey, get Deuteronomy yeah, 22. Yeah, yeah. Lucky, yeah, you're you're so lucky it. America did away yeah, with the Bible. Get, get the right scriptures. Man. Yeah. America, they, look, they lucky that America did away with the laws of the Bible. I thought it was snatched. 
if she wasn't belonging to someone else. The Bible That's said we saying. can just snatch uh, women up, bro. There's a law in the, the Bible that the, says we can take a woman. The the people who established this kingdom, the feminized men so yeah. much. So badly. Okay, the black. lions are gone. The li the men the Have men you? are gone. Yep. Like, no more lying in it. A bunch of, oh, that's why you see so many faggots walking around. Every other person you see is a homosexual. Is, well, a homosexual is, is, is a production of a man. A whole bunch of demons with, on uh, that without, without a father growing up as a child. So it's well, that's, that's, that's part of that's it. That's part of the system. system. That's, part man. Of, that's, part of, that's part of the New World Order system, the communist system. That's what it's all about. Oh, what's that? You know, you know where that's that's why that's why Let me get a description. That's why. Yeah. Let me get a description real quick. Oh, Jesus Christ himself was a feminine man. Oh, he was. What? <laughs> man, first time watching the history, man. You speak in blasphemy. Hey, you know, like if he was oh, feminist, how the fuck could he flip over a wooden table? All right, now this is what Jesus said. Uh, the Bible said he's an awesome um, man. Matthew 10 and 34. Oh, this is what the Lord said. Tell me this Think is not that I come to send peace on earth. This is, this is red letters. I came not to send peace, but a sword. Read it again. That motorcycle. Yeah, that sounds very feminine. I heard it. I came not to send peace, but a sword. So the Lord, he ain't, he ain't feminine. He's a, the Bible says the Lord is a man of so peace. He, so, he's, so he's pretty much saying no woman having your thought process peace. Yeah, ain't no peace. He said make not. Don't even have in your mind. Because Carl Tim. Like so we're just supposed line, to walk right? around killing people. Yeah. yeah. We didn't no, say that. No, no, that's not the time we for that. That, that time's coming. We we telling you what's supposed to happen, okay? Because first of all, a faggot is supposed to get put to death. Like an adulterer is supposed to get put to death, right? But yeah. listen to me for Old a second. Testament. I'm about to explain it to you. An adult, we're all worthy of death. Right. We've all committed adultery whether we know it or not. Right. If you had sex with any woman who is not a virgin, you're guilty of death and you should be put to death on the spot. But you're not going to get put to death because the Lord came to forgive us of our sins. So we're supposed to teach people to stop being a demon, to stop committing adultery, stop being a fag. Well, they gonna stop. The fag is going to be a fag. Once a fag, it's always a fag. No, no, no. That's not true. Oh, uh, here you go. go. This is Deuteronomy uh, 22 and... Um, 25. Yeah, listen to this. But if a man find a betrothed damsel in the field, and the man forced her and lied with her, then the man only that lay with her shall die. So but, this is talking about uh, if, you, if, if you see a woman that's not, if you see a woman that's betrothed that belongs to another man, and you lay with her, you get put to death for that. Okay, that's the law. So keep going. But unto the damsel thou shalt do nothing. There is a there is in the damsel no sin worthy of death, for as when a man rises against his neighbor and slayeth him, even so is this matter. So, for, so, so it's only lust when you lust after someone else's woman. Okay, you're allowed to like a woman who doesn't have a man. Okay, there's nothing wrong with that. that that's called being manly. There's nothing wrong with like a woman. Get, this one get more specific. For he found her in the field and he would draw damsel pride and there was none to save her. If a man find a damsel that is a virgin. If a man find a damsel that is a virgin, keep going. Which is not betrothed. Which is not betrothed means she doesn't belong to any man, right? And, and lay hold on her. Lay hold on her. And lie with her. Takes her and lays with her. And they be found. And they be found. Then the man that lay with her shall give unto the damsel's father 50 shekels of silver, and she shall be his wife. So you, you can just take a woman. We're not telling nobody to do that. But according to the laws in the Bible, there's nothing wrong with looking at a woman like, damn, that looks good, I'm taking that. Right. There's nothing wrong with that. I got to show you that people don't do it. Besides the fact that it And we just read it, bro, it's right, right there in the Bible. Man. Do you believe in the Bible or yeah. do you believe in the devil? If you believe in the Bible, man, you can to believe in everything that's I'm written. I'm being part of That's what I'm doing. Oh, this is oh right. man. <laughs> back oh, man. Yeah, it's like the yeah, leak no, over no, here, boy. No, um, no. Um, Hold on, let me show you something. You got, you got, you got to agree with everything in the Bible. Yeah, but you live with a person, then you have to marry a person. Of course yeah, you got to marry. Of course you have to marry. That's, you just, you lay with her when you went inside her. That's your marriage. When you, when you popped her, when you had sex with her. That's you, marriage. That's marriage. No putting. Where is it in the Bible to put a ring, a, a satanic ring? Right, I mean like virgin. Right. You know. Well, having sex is marriage in the Bible. The Bible said when uh, when Adam knew Eve that he took that, then she was his wife. Knew. Hey, about close the block. Yeah, but it also says 
um, that man shall abide by the laws of the land. And that's the law. The law is once you have sex with a woman, you be you and that woman's spirit get become. Get get I, I still gotta say, it. when a woman and a man lay together, their spirits become one through the act of sexual intercourse. The hell they got bomb friends? Like, you never know what you got to do with Oh man, you just took the boy's name in vain. No, that's not, that's that was name. not his name. God yeah. damn. Look, they're closing damn. off the oh, block God. for real. God damn. God is not his name. God is a title. It's English. The Bible is it's right. right. God's name is in Hebrew. God is just a generic term. Why they just got it? Probably a bomb friend or something. That's a brotherhood. You farm them up. You farm a brotherhood. They don't want a bunch of homosexuals themselves. Pedophiles. I got a clip of this. Proverbs 30. Listen to this, bro. Listen to this. Proverbs 30 and 5. Every word of God is pure. So, you're talking about, oh, that's the Old Testament. It says every word of God is pure. Right. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to follow from the old, from the book of Genesis all the way to the book of Revelation. Okay? The whole book. And if you don't know the Old Testament, you ain't going to know the New Testament. I'll get a scripture to prove that. Oh, let me hear with this one last scripture. We've been in here for hours. Where do you guys go to church at? This, we are at church. Well, church. Church is a Greek word that means to call out. You got to call out on the streets. You can't call out in the building. You know why it's going to hear you. I'm gonna show you denying the Old Testament. I'm gonna show you something. This is this for the one you call Jesus said. Here's 18. This is John. Uh -huh. <laughs> can, hey, can I use the book of John? Is that acceptable? <laughs> Am I allowed to use John? I mean, it's, it's in the New Testament, right? New Testament. It's not the old. Look, John 5 and 45. Do not think that I will accuse you to the Father. There is one that accuses you, even Moses, in whom ye trust. For had ye believed Moses, hmm. ye would have believed me, for he wrote of me. Woo. So, uh, Moses wrote Deuteronomy, what we read, where he said you can take a woman. Okay, so if you don't believe that, he said, but if ye believe not his writing, <laughs> how shall ye believe my words? <laughs> Play his simple, bro. Play his simple. We ain't out here to deceive nobody. We ain't trying to deceive nobody. We don't. Pro we won't profit from that. Nah. You know, like I said, we out here to crush falsehood and teach truth. We, we, are, we, we condemn the wicked. We operate on factual information. We, we are the prophets of the Lord. You know, whether you want to accept it or not. We are the prophets. Right. You know, Bible. before every nation was destroyed in the past, the Most High sent out prophets to warn that nation and tell those heathens why they're about to be destroyed. Yep. That's what we're doing now. America's going to be destroyed. We're going to be delivered. We're going to meet the Lord in the air like the scripture says. That's my, that's our goal. We are, that's, that's our faith is to get delivered up out of here. Hey, but our job is also to save people. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to save, save the elect. We can't, you can't save people that's already been condemned by the Most High himself. We only here to wake up the elect. And not just the elect that, uh, that, that chosen of the 144,000. I'm talking about the elect of the multitudes that's going to come toward the Lord and, when his deliverance comes. That, and that's why the Lord said, love not the world. That's right. Neither, yeah. neither the things leave, in the world. I already see it coming. What's up? Yeah, get about you guys anything odd tonight? No, anybody no, wandering around doing anything? Setting up any smoke bombs? Doing anything crazy? Oh, we've seen a... I mean, you've had this video camera going, so did you happen to catch any video over that way? Anybody doing no. anything odd? All we've seen is these hillbillies driving by honking a loud ass horn blowing our ears out. Yeah, what happened? There's a lot of people out here. There's smoke bonds yeah. over there. Well, I mean, you guys so sure if you no, we didn't not see nothing. Stops long enough to ever look. You know, most people right. buzz on by. Right. So right. you guys sign. Yeah, we wouldn't notice anyway. We're doing too much reading. Sounds good. <laughs> Sounds good. All right, man. I tell you what, when we watch the video and we happen to see something, we let y'all know. That'd be cool. All right. Appreciate it. Yeah. Take care. You guys, they, they probably stayed in some false flags. There's a bond there. Every other day down here now. Yesterday there was a police headquarters. Yeah, something's big about to happen. Something's big about to happen. And all this is leading to the Lord coming. Everything that's happening. This ain't. This is going on all over America. Chaos. There's going to be riots. There's going to be race wars. 
You know, it's gonna be with martial law. You familiar with martial law? Yeah, oh, yeah. Shit. It's coming. Do yeah, you want a Bible? I mean, they didn't write these laws into into. In, into it's got a six 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 on it. The prison Bible. You, you know, see they, that? They, it says six six six. Martial law in the United States before. They locked every those Japanese six, up six, what in what concentration camps before. So all those things that happened in the past are trial runs. Well, Don't be surprised. Yeah, October first, there'll be uh, some type of major drill happens. Don't be surprised. October first. October. That's just nice. You know. Marshall, you getting ready for the end. They getting ready for something that's coming. You know, we went. We, that's we out here in the morning. So when it happens, you will know why. You know, as a matter of fact, you will know you've been warned. Lord when this happens, you gonna know who we were. Yeah, Lord come back. Yes, Everybody's gonna take the yes, yes, Pull the rug from his feet. <laughs> oh, they left already. I'll see. I thought it was about to get blown it up. It ain't gonna be nothing pretty when the Lord comes, man. I'm telling you. It's gonna be. Uh, That's probably uh, just leading to getting us up out of here. There's a bloody mess. You're here. probably just trying to get us up off the street right here. Oh, man. Like doing shit like that. It's gonna be a bloody mess you know? when the Lord comes. The, the uh, book of Amos says it's the day the Lord is chopped off. The day the Lord is darkness and not light. Right? Yeah, Bro, I'll yeah. tell you what, Bible, no, the Bible is not what you think it is, man. The Bible is the book of destruction. Thank you. Destruction. <laughs> Great king. It's a manly book. It's only for men to read. That's why the only Lord, for men. That's why the Lord said, book. He said, the Lord is a man of war. That's why right. the Lord is a man. Well, he likes war. That's why he said he ain't coming to bring peace. The Lord is host. The Lord is host. Oh, and the Lord is Sabaoth. Oh, you know what Sabaoth oh, 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 oh. The Lord of the Army. That's in the New Testament. They call him the Lord of Sabaoth, oh, the Lord of the Army. The Lord of hosts. The tabernacle of the Most High is with men. Men. Not men and women. Yeah, not men and women. What's going to happen is going to be for the, 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 the strong. It's going to be meant for the strong to survive. That's how crazy this shit going to get. That's how it's going to get. That's going to wait when we're going to wake up strong. Like, about time. Some, like I say, the Bible says to pray for this day to come. Yep. You know, I want to be in the kingdom. I don't want to be in oppressed anymore. We don't want to live in this shit. We're being oppressed in this in this world. You, oppressed. You, you like living in America and living where everybody is okay to be a homosexual, you can be a transvestite. Disease is running rampant. You, you can go join the church of Satan. Ooh. You can actually join the church of Satan. It's, it's like a real church founded by Anton LaVey. You can, you can follow Aleister Crowley. You can walk down the street with a pentagram t-shirt. Hey, I can chop my horse. dick into a pussy. Yep, you can chop your dick off, get a pussy. You know what I'm saying? You, you can sell You can, you sell can have abortions. You can sell dildos on the corner. Oh, you make, you be rich, dude. Yeah, you can make all kind of money doing that. You can make pornos. Bitches loud fucking horses. A bitch can yep. never have enough dildos. I've seen when they the corners were open. And it was full of different colors and shapes, sizes, and they got electrical. They got <laughs> something to plug into the wall. You know what I'm saying? They got they manual got dildos this damn big. Manual and automatic. <laughs> they got some that got have some water that guns in them. You push a button, it squirts. Squirts nut, yeah. It's fake nut, but you can fill it up with fake sperm. Lotion. Work. We work. We do what we need to do. This is the work. It's the only work that matters, bro. The only work that matters, everything else is bullshit. If you're not doing this work, you ain't doing no work. I work with the disability, people with disabilities. Where you from? the south side, son. South side, nigga. <laughs> what do you guys look at now? Oh, this dude's an agent, man. He's trying to find out everything. Even though it's social security number. Well, my bank routing back. number and bank account <laughs> number. <laughs> no, no, no. I just I'm a friendly guy. Yeah, so, you, so you, yeah, you, you an issue. He's an issue. You about to go back to Potter's house now? I can tell about just the way he opens, yeah. way he opens like stands up how his mouth is. Potter's house is so open now, this late. So now it's your job to go back there and hit them. If you don't go back there and hit them with those scriptures that we gave you. You probably don't forgot him. Yeah, you should go ask your That's pastor video, about that right? shit. Uh, it's on. It'll be on YouTube. What's it called? You can get it. You on Twitter? No. Well, that's the easy way to find. That's it. the devil. <laughs> no, I mean, you, got, you, know, actually, you, you know what? <laughs> the internet is in the Bible. Yeah, it's in the Bible. Yeah. Yeah. The internet. He talks about the internet. Check this out. That's how you, you got an internet access going. Yeah. Yeah. Um.
um, woe unto the, the wicked. You can what? The easy, I bet the easiest way to really search though. Oh, that's a, that's a description. Because you ain't gotta have to the wicked. you ain't gotta have that a Twitter account. You know? The best way to find our YouTube channels though is you can go on YouTube and search for yeah, woe unto the wicked. Mm -hmm. That's a good way, but you probably get some truth Irish and shit will pop up too. You ain't lying, man. Cause you hit up our videos and or the or the L, we got elders, yeah. GMS. GMS. A lot of the false will come up. So, so you yeah, got to write it down specifically. Yeah, Great Millstone. Right. But yeah, but the best way to find is though, actually. Who taught you guys this stuff? Elders. Our elders, the ones, of, the elders of GMS. Great Millstone, that's in the Bible. Where's that? Great Millstone. But they're up in New York. So you went to New York to learn this? No, it's on the internet, man. Yeah. That's we in the future. We're just in the year 2013. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, so how do I find your YouTube video? Woe well unto the wicked. Woe well unto the wicked on YouTube. Or Mike got no pencil paper? You can search for Kings of the Earth on Twitter. Woe well unto the wicked. The wicked. I mean, well really, you the just type in woe well unto the wicked. That'll pop you. up too. I, mean, I don't know though. That's true, Thyrus. You gotta well write it down the way it is, wicked. man. man well, like you gotta write it down, down the way it is. Into. Hey, you, get, you, oh, you never know. He might wake up, man. Oh, I got. Two, we got two chances. There's two on to the wicked. Always good to do your own you know, she stops coughing. Really yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know, you never know, man. Research. Never know, man. You know, what I'm saying, look, look up history, find out what's in history. And all you gotta that. study everything, you man. Gotta study everything. Right. You gotta become a scholar. UFOs. The, the, the scriptures say Hebrew study. Hebrew language. You, know, you gotta learn Hebrew. How do you think the Lord left? How do you think the, the Lord left? Oh, well, man, they call nah. it. Well, they call Lord, it we we give you. We give it to you some other time. Well, you got a pen. They give me a pen. Some other time. I might have one. <laughs> you hear about that that chariot that they thought it was they thought it was the Japs invading? Oh yeah. It was back yeah, in 1940 yeah. some. The one, I, the one, that. the video I showed you when they were at the spotlight. Yeah, yeah, that's the one you showed me. Yeah, yeah. yeah I seen it on. Uh, no, they we had a pen before. Check this out. I usually have a pen. I ain't, I ain't got shit to do. I, ain't, I really ain't in a hurry to go no more. Because the elites, the elites, I, you know what I mean, man. Kingdom, they, I'm, I'm know, go home. they know what's going on. Gonna they go know. We're going to go drink some Tecate. That's why they call them damn them chariots you have heard. They be paranoid. Too, man. What's wrong with drinking it? The Lord drank at the Last Supper. Everybody was oh, drinking wine. Drink, well, the Lord didn't drink at the Last Supper. Oh, you can't but hold up. At the Last it's Supper, the, what did the Lord say about wine? About that wine at the Last Supper? This is what I would do. What's a bunch of lights in the cloud? <laughs> oh yeah, that's that's what you that's what you showed me. Yeah, that was something. Oh yeah, UFO video. I think you should show me that one, dude. Man, there's billions of videos, man. The proof is endless. We should, I, you can just look up at the sky right now. It's probably, oh, it's probably too much poop. Light pollution that? right now. You know where the uh, race track is? Oh, sorry. Horse race track? Yeah, yeah. Woe unto the wicked, right? Yeah, or woe unto the wicked, too. Woe, woe unto the reason, actually, because our channels always get deleted. So there was a channel called Woe unto the wicked, but it got deleted. So I could, I wanted to have the same name, but I couldn't, so I called it Woe unto the wicked. That's the actual URL, you know what I mean? You put in the YouTube slash user slash woe to the uh, woe to the wicked, and then it's also woe unto the wicked too. I'll find it. So you got your black woman. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you actually want a black woman. A wanted or one? Wanted. That's a curse. One. Yeah. Oh, I took it. Uh, yeah, he, he said he took it. He said he took it. it. He took it. <laughs> <laughs> That's man, I thought, I, I thought we can't take no women though. The only reason why you you, you connected with her because you a black man yourself. Yeah, maybe, man. No, ain't no I maybe too. Ain't no maybe too. And we come in different flavors, man. The black men come in different flavors. Yeah, the, uh, the Just because uh, somebody yeah. look white, man, you gotta learn to look at people's spirit, and then you'll be like, oh, okay, okay. you know. It's not all white. Well, you know, a lot of people. Well, not all white people are the same. That's obvious. Right. All black people are the same. Yeah, but yeah, all black people ain't Israelites. Right. Just because you black. That's the most high, he created. Just like he created a specific spider, like a tarantula, right? There's different types of tarantulas. Mm. Then you got shit like yeah, black widows. Type of beetles. You know, you got different kind. You yeah, got you thousands can... of different types of spiders. Yeah. So with the Lord's people himself, he, he there's different. They look different. Yep. You know, that's he's just dealing with. That's just how the Most High. He like they. He like different stuff. You know, like the cat world. How many different kinds of cats are? Whew. 
Some, you know? some of them are better than others. You yes, know what some I mean? are bigger and better. The lion, right. the lion's the king of the jungle. And that's us. Right? <laughs> so then, and Israel is like him to the lion from the tribe of Judah. That's right. You know what I mean? That's right. White people come, you know, like I said, I don't white people you see all the same. Something. You know? And that, that's why you can't. If, if you really want it, man, if you really want to learn more, you're going to, the spirit will lead you there. But if not, man, you can continue in darkness. Yep. This light, this truth opens your eyes up to sit that you. Man, it's amazing, man. I can't even put it in words. There's a scripture in the Bible that the, uh, I think it was Paul that he was, who was that? He was, he was looking, he saw the kingdom of heaven, oh, he and he said up. it was unlawful for him to describe it. Oh, yeah. So, he went, unlawful? He was unspeakable. He couldn't even speak about right. it. Right. It was too great. So we came, just just like we teach in this word, we came explaining how it changed our lives. Let me ask you a question. I laid with a woman who wasn't a virgin, had a baby with her. That's then right. I laid with a virgin. Which one do I marry? Both of them. You can have both of them. Both of them. The Lord forgives you, though. The Lord forgives forgive you, though. He'll forgive you for that. If you do it out of ignorance, he'll forgive you. You do it again. Oh, Solomon had a Willingly. Oh, that man, that woman got a husband that woman, he go to work and he I like that booty booty. Man, actually, Let me go hit it anyway. Oh, no, no, I didn't sleep with any, any man. No. But actually, it's like this. But in America, all these women are hoes. All these women, you ain't really find no virgin. Even if she told me she's a virgin, she's fine. But the women will lie about that, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I understand. So what do you do, man? You marry I mean, the woman that you're pregnant, or you marry the woman that was a virgin? You already married. You already had sex with her. You already married. But you really, you ain't got no wife in this team, right? Because they going to leave you anyway. It's only temporary. Everything right now in this world is temporary. Right. You know I mean? You can try your best to keep your family together, but this family don't stand a chance. Yeah, you don't get the one, you get the turn. Yeah, you really get a turn with a woman. You don't have a woman, you have a turn. you Yeah, yeah. Everybody has Because in this country, a woman, any time she wants an American, can get up and leave you. And there's nothing you can do about it. Right? Yeah. There's nothing you can't stop her. And she'll, she'll go commit adultery on you, and then she'll go and collect child support on you. Yeah, and she'll then get, the Bible says, though, but the Bible says that like, any, woman should, any woman that commits adultery should be shunned. Like, she's she put to death. Yeah, she should yeah. be killed. The, the adulterer yeah. and adulterers. Both yeah, of them. Both in of America, them. they get rewarded. In yeah. America, they get rewarded. They get Section 8. <laughs> they get food stamps, child support, alimony, mm. all that. Mm. Plus more. Mm. Mm. Plus your house. Plus, plus your, your car. Your house, plus your the car. dog. Everything. They you get know? everything. That's, that's, that's totally wicked. That's totally Those are curses, though. Those are curses to Israel. Israelites. You don't apply them to the Them nations don't, they don't experience this type of grief. And if they do, they don't, they don't, they didn't want that woman anyway. Because they're a fact. Oh, uh, yeah, the Muslim nation, they don't tolerate that. They don't want to tolerate abortions. A woman can, she, you get a woman pregnant. You know, she two things. I have a wisdom to coming in. Woo! In, in this country, you can get a woman pregnant and she gonna kill your baby, bro. Yeah. She, she'll go kill your baby. There's nothing you can do about it. I know women that's had 15, 20 abortions. <laughs> yep, that is, that's, that's no joke. Yeah, seriously. They, they had so many abortions, can't have babies no more. Can't have a baby. Yep, no they done messed their insides up. They'll fuck themselves up. Yep. Yep. And you see a lot of these women, that's why a lot of you see a lot of women in their uh, uh, late 30s, 40s, 50s, don't got no kids because they didn't all tore them, their pussy. All them abortions. Mm -hmm. Well, these university women are the big. That's you want oh, you, so. you want you a whore. This is what well, you make. They don't teach nothing but that liberal lunatic shit up in here. Uh, all these schools they're liberal as hell. All they teach is bag of rights, women rights, men are nothing. Uh, you know what I mean? And it's all about breaking up the family. They go and they teach you about Homer. You know, uh, not Homer, but they teach you Homer too. Plato. <laughs> Plato, yeah. You ever heard of Plato? He's a philosopher. These colleges worship Plato. If you go there, uh, take a, a philosophy course, they go the first thing they're gonna give you some Plato. And uh, pretty much America follows a lot of uh, what they Platonic beliefs. They believe they follow Plato. And one of the things that Plato said was that in a perfect world, in a perfect world there'd be no families, and uh, the children would be raised by the state, and no child would even know who their mother and father were. That's in a perfect world? Well, they're just saying in their utopia, in their uh, demonic yeah. utopia, their new world. They, they would say no child would ever know who their father was, yeah. or, you know, who their mother was. As soon as he was born, it was taken away from the, 
parents. New world order. And raised, raised by the NWO. state. That's what America is doing right now. That's what they're building towards. And it's getting real close to that. But they never get there. Because the whole side's coming. The Lord's coming. He's going to change. Oh, shit. It's out of space. It's all good. Don't He's going to